Greetings, High Society. Welcome back to another battle video. Week one, season three, 5S Thorin Shilbert Spectacular Scrim Society. It's Lab Dog, the commissioner. And today we are going to be watching the Denver Nine Tails versus the LA Kinglers. So we'll be looking from Nine Tails perspective here. And we'll see how it goes. So LA Kinglers, both of these are. Uh, Original teams since season one, but LA has a new coach, Jake. So we'll see how uh, Jake does here going up against a uh, team that's made it to the final four each season in Denver. All right, so let's see. LA is bringing Drake Azul, Nine Tails, Seismato, G Max Pawaso, Wabatha, and Togedamaru. Nine Tails is defending with the trio Torkoal, G Max Venusaur, Darmanitan. Quillfish and Heliolisk. So, Sun Team over here. Very interesting. I think it's interesting bringing the Nine Tails here. I'd hate to see the uh, opponent set up Denver's own Sun for them. That's none of my business. All right, here we go. Week one, new season. In the preseason power rankings, we gave the top overall team to Denver. So let's see how LA performs against them. LA, for those who missed last week's podcast, he was on. He did not make it to the draft, so he got a completely random team. So let's see what he can do with a random Pokemon here. So Quillfish against Togedomaru. Gets the Intimidate off, but does not want to stay in it seems against that electric type. Going out to Doug Trio. Good switch, Arena Trap. Blue Nose, Zing Zap, nope. Does not affect Doug Trio. Earthquake, four times effective against Togedomaru. Let's see. He cannot switch out. I bet he's trying to switch out. He cannot. Arena Trap, that's why Doug Trio is S tier in the league. Some people underestimate the ability to trap your opponent. Let's see what Toby tomorrow can do here. Doug Trio gets the Earthquake off. Will this KO? No, Toby tomorrow hangs on. Sturdy is the ability, not Iron Barbs or Lightning Rod, Bell Stinger, that won't do a lot. The Trio Choice Scarf, so it's going to have to keep clicking that Earthquake. All right, Togedomaru down, Doug Trio, the first KO. Nine tails send out. That is not what you want, LA. You do not want a fire type against Doug Trio. Would have liked to have seen Seismato come out here. Or we'll, we'll see later. Earthquake takes down the nine tails. Doug Trio, two KOs, going for the sweep early. Denver and Denver's the Sun team and LA made that mistake now of setting up the Sun for them. So let's see. LA sends out Wab effect. Let's see. I mean the trio's stuck here earthquaking. The trio goes for an earthquake. Gets Wab effect down to just below half. Wobbuffet, Destiny Bond, would have liked to have seen a counter there. That would have taken down the Doug Trio. Now, Wobbuffet has the Shadow Tag ability, so Doug Trio cannot switch out. So it's going to be forced to Earthquake, and the Destiny Bond will take it out here. But again, a, a counter there would have taken down the Doug Trio and left Wobbuffet still alive to absorb another hit. Destiny Bond takes down Doug Trio, so the sweep 
is not in. Hmm. Let's see. Not G Max Venusaur comes out. Oh, that is not what you want in front of the Venusaur here. Venusaur going straight for that G Max. Seismito is going to have to get out of there. Cool swap in. Colossal. He's gonna be able to survive this G Max whiplash though. Let's see, it's neutral. The fire resists, but the rock is weak. Let's see how bulky this is. Either way, this is gonna hurt in the Vines might take it out anyway. No, a clean one hit KO from the G Max Vine Lash. And that's LA's G Max taken down. Not a good start. Drake result comes out. Do not appreciate this quake. In the sun, chlorophyll doubling Venusaur speed gets off a max quake. Clean KO on the Dracozole, leaving only the Seismitoad now, and we know how that goes. The sun is gone. LA left only with Seismitoad. Denver, one more turn, G Max Venusaur goes for the Vine Lash. Seismitoad has a look on his face, he knows what's coming. Oh, and another clean one hit KO. The cream rises to the top. Denver off to a 1 0 start in season three. Just a very poor matchup, I think in terms for LA, but a good win for Denver. So guys, watch the rest of our week one season three videos and make sure to check out tonight's podcast where we recap the week one along with fellow YouTuber, the Poke Card Collector, the Green Code Card King. Say that 10 times fast. All right, society. Stay classy. We'll see you next time.